it's hard to imagine what this world would look like when the music just disappear, after all, we enjoy losing ourselves in the melody anytime we want to relax, that's why we love the iPod so much. So naturally you'd panic when you forgot the passcode, it says iPod is disabled, and the remaining time escalating. Is there a way to get into it without using the passcode? Thank God the answer is yes, in this video we'll give you three ways to make it. Let's jump in. No computer around? Not a problem. If you have signed in an Apple ID on this iPod and enabled Find My iPod, then you can unlock it using the Find My app on your iPhone, here is how. On your iPhone, go to Settings, make sure to sign in the same Apple ID and enable Find My. Then open the Find My app. Tap Devices. Swipe up. Then tap your iPod. Now you should see the Erase This Device option in the bottom, go ahead and tap on it. Then enter your Apple ID and password to continue. Now you can see your iPod has automatically got into the erase process. This will bringing you to the hello screen, then you can unlock it using your Apple ID. If find my iPod is not turned on for this device, here is how to achieve the same goal using iTunes, which allows you to do a restore in recovery mode without using any credentials. So once open it, plug your iPod into the computer, then put it into recovery mode. For iPod Touch, is press and hold both the top and home buttons simultaneously till you see the connect to computer icon. Then iTunes should recognize it and tell you to update or restore. We are going to choose the restore. Then hit restore and update to confirm. It'll be downloading the firmware first, then your iPod will go through the restore process. If iTunes is giving you errors, here is the ultimate solution, unlock iPod with 4 Yuki iPhone passcode unlocker. There's a link in the description below if you'd like to download. So once open it, plug your iPod into the computer, then put it into recovery mode as you do with iTunes. Then go to the unlock lock screen passcode field, click start to proceed. Download the firmware, then here we go. Well done, now it says the passcode removed successfully, let's go ahead and set it up. You can set your own passcode now or leave it there till you get the home screen. So there it is, finally we did it. Now you can sync music from iTunes library and start over. That's it, thanks for watching. See you in the next video.